Please stand, face the flag, put your right hand over your heart, ready, begin. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Good morning, Bears. I'm Laszlo Ivazi. And I'm JP Ferrante. Coming up, a sports update and club news. Today is Tuesday, April 18th, and Good Morning John Burroughs starts right now. Welcome back. As we are getting closer to the end of the school year, there are important deadlines coming up. The final due date for library books is May 10. Any books still checked out after that time will earn an in-debt. This date does not include textbooks and novels for class. Seniors who want to apply for the Burbank Art Association Scholarship, the deadline is almost here. All applications and supporting documents are due by this Sunday at midnight. See the Bulletin or the Career Center for more information. Looking at our clubs this week, the Aqua Lions Club is having a water walk on campus this upcoming Saturday. This event will take place on the track from 10 a.m. to 1 p.m. Scan the two QR codes on the screen if you would like to volunteer or donate to the walk. In other club news, the nursing club meets tomorrow at lunch in room 2208. The Armenian club also has an important meeting tomorrow at lunch in room 1215. Environmental cleanup club meets on Thursday to discuss the plant a flower day. And finally, if you borrowed a placard during Saga's open mic event, please return it to Miss Weiner in room 1216 so they can be used in the future. Uh, also, come out to support the combined Burbank Unified Winter Color Guard and Burroughs Winter Percussion this Friday night at 7.30. Admission is only $5 at the door and will take place at Burbank High's main gym. Speaking of the Armenian Club, this week's club is hosting activities to help commemorate and raise awareness for the Armenian Genocide. Today is a poster painting activity during lunch. Tomorrow will be a school-wide assembly during AE and a guest speaker during lunch. We are over halfway through the spring semester, but all of our spring sports are still in action. Many teams are getting close to the end of the Pacific League play, so let's check in with our sports update. Good morning, Bears. This is Ava Gorman, and I've got your spring sports update today. Boys tennis is back on the court this week. JV is home against Pasadena. Varsity is away. Both teams play at 345. Swim is also in action today at home against the Bulldogs. Their meet starts at 3.30. Boys volleyball is home today after a win against Pasadena last week. Both Frosh and JV play at 5.45, varsity at 6. The Bears are currently third in the Pacific League. Baseball is all on the road. JV is at CV at 3.30, varsity plays at 6. That's all for me. Now back to you. Looking forward to sports next year? If you're interested in playing girls volleyball in the fall, tryouts will be next week. They will take place on Tuesday, April 25th at 3.30. Make sure to have your athletic clearance and bring the latest report card with you. See Coach Rao in the PE office with any questions. Seniors, if you are interested in attending GCC next there is an informational session for the Early College Acceptance Program next week. The Zoom session will take place on April 26th from 4.30 to 6. See the bulletin for the Zoom link. This is also the last call for AP African American Studies for next year. This AP level elective course is part of a nationwide pilot program and is still available for registration. See your counselor for more details and to sign up. Well, that's all for today, Bears. We'll be back on Thursday. I'm JP Ferrante. And I'm Laszlo Vazian. Have a great day, Bears.